Hello Temecula, I'm Christine Damco of the City of Temecula. I'm here today at the Habitat for Humanity Design Center. Are you looking for great furnishings, home decor, or home good items all at a low cost for a good cause? Well look no further here at Habitat for Humanity Design Center. Let's go talk to the store manager to check out what a great resource this store is for the community. I'm here with Alan, the store manager. Alan, can you tell us what is the Habitat for Humanity Design Center? The Habitat for Humanity Design Center is 30, roughly 35,000 square feet of retail shopping space. We have home improvement goods, we have odds and ends, we have home goods, we have furniture, as you see. Uh, it comes from a variety of sources. One of the cool and unique things about this center is some of the items that you offer are brand new. Tell us, can you tell us more about that? Well, um, yes, we, we've been very blessed. We're very lucky that uh, some of the companies that donate to us donate um, brand new items, gently used items, items that shouldn't have been shipped to them. There are a number of reasons why we get the things we do, but we do, we have a number of brand new items in here, yes. And here at the Design Center, not only are you having a great time treasure hunting, but it's also going to a good cause and helping our community, Habitat for Humanity, a local nonprofit. Can you tell us about Habitat for Humanity? Sure. Um, we are Habitat for Humanity Inland Valley. We uh, cover seven cities in the Southwest Riverside County. Um, we have several programs. Everyone knows about our home building program, which is obviously the, the main focus and, and what all of these proceeds really go to. But we also have home improvement programs. We have educational construction educational programs that we do. Uh, we do a lot of different things, anything we can think of to help the community. And I, as I was walking through the store, I noticed some gorgeous, it looks like handmade wine bottle holders out of wood pallets. Yes. Uh, is, that, is that from a, one of your programs? It's one of our new programs. Uh, our director of restores came up with the idea. Um, I think it's brilliant. Something a lot of people don't know, um, over the years, Habitat has diverted 11,000 tons, actually more than that now, 11,000 tons of trash from landfills. Uh, a lot of that is what you see here. A lot of this would end up in a landfill. A lot of things that we can't sell still end up there, but um, my director came up with the idea that if there's anything that we can take and we can use that as raw material to make something else, we should do that. And so we've started doing that and, and we have a lot of very talented people that work in the back. They see things that other people might not see and they build whatever they can. And it, it's, it's really nice. Yeah, what gems, yes. what wonderful gems you have here. So speaking of Habitat for Humanity and the holidays coming, you also have a program at the Promenade Mall a beautiful program. Tell us about that. That would be our Christmas tree lane. Um, if you're looking for it, it's in the middle of the mall. We have 20 to 25 designer decorated Christmas trees that you can come by. You can buy a raffle ticket, you can, or 10 or 20. Um, and you can win a Christmas tree that you can keep for years and years. And they're all individual, they're all really neat. It's a, it's a, they put a lot of work into that, it's cool. Yes, I can testify to that. I have been through that. I. It's kind of a family tradition. We go every year and they are gorgeous trees and uh, your contribution also helps the community. So it does, a yes. double whammy there. Yes. Well, Ellen, I am, I think I'm gonna go shopping at this. Please. Uh, look at some furniture over here and uh, thank you very much. You're very welcome. Okay. 